What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Jordy and welcome back to Watch Dogs Legion. One year later, over a year later actually, since the game came out. And it has been, I wouldn't say a wild ride, but it's been an eventful one to say the least. Especially when it comes to um, the season pass really. Um, so in this video, we are just going to be talking about the single player, the campaign, and uh, just really go over my overall thoughts on it since we last played the single player, which was a very long time ago, come to think of it. Um, I am leaving online for its own video. I'm going to be working on a video for Watch Dogs Legion Online because I have a lot to say about it. Now, the reason that those that those two videos including this one are separated is because I have a lot of positive things to say about the campaign. I have a lot of negative things to say for online. So this is going to be a light-hearted looking back uh, at the game in a positive manner, a nostalgic manner, even though it's only been a year. Uh, I will not be covering Legion of the Dead. I will cover it briefly in the online video, but yeah, there's really not much to say about Legion of the Dead. It's just okay. And Bloodline, I have yet to play it, but it's really good from what I've seen. I'm very much looking forward to playing this. Actually, by the time this video comes out, maybe I've already live streamed uh, the first episode of Bloodline, but uh, again, we'll have to see. Uh, I just know it will not come out on the same day as I'm dropping this video because Fall Guys' new season is out uh, on November 30th, which is when I plan to put out this video. So uh, right now it is November 28th, which is the day I plan to play San Andreas. So November 29th should be the Bloodline stream. So if you're watching this video, I most likely live stream this last night. So go ahead and watch that if you want to. Either way, let's get into the campaign. It has been a long time since I've actually played it. There's a new game option now, I think. I don't know. Let's just get into this. Um, first of all, so what? Watch Dogs Legion came out in October 2020. I was really hyped for this game, by the way. So hyped. Um, we've had we we had trailers for Legion since what early 2019, something like that. And the, the second we found out that it was in London, everybody was hyped for it. It was honestly amazing. It was incredible. And it didn't, the game didn't quite meet expectations. Um, personally, I thought it was going to be a lot like Watch Dogs and Watch Dogs 2. But for a lot of it, it's just, it's more like a side project, you know? Good it's not called Watch Dogs 3 because it doesn't really build off of those two games, like, at all. Legion seems like its own game. Legion seems like it's made by totally different developers, you know? Um, it's a bit odd, but uh, I'll, I'll discuss more of that when we actually get into the gameplay. Let's roll. Let's roll. Oh my god, I remember this character. I spent so much time customizing this guy. Oh, this is going to give me all my rewards as well, isn't it? Hell yeah, radio dead sec, vehicle paint. Okay, so here we are back in Watch Dogs Legion. I have a lot of rewards, by the way. Um, oh yeah, there's something about the season. Oh, we got Aiden Pierce's uh, map. Oh yeah, we're getting all of... Oh my god, look at... So... One thing I am going to point out about online is that the rewards carry over. Wait, are we actually getting Aiden Pierce's and Wrench's outfits and stuff? Wait, so I swear that's part of the pass, but I, I guess if you have the, I mean, uh, you know, the online pass. But I guess if you have the season pass, then you can kind of overwrite this. Uh, honestly, half of these outfits that are coming up, I genuinely don't recognize. But we are getting, oh, we got the Assassin's Creed outfit as well, along with Aiden's hat, of course. But we already, already had that. You get it through Ubisoft Connect. That reminds me, I need to buy Tom Clancy's The Division. Oh my god. Still ain't bought that yet. It's only two quid. I just need to find the time, really. I really haven't had that much time. We're getting so many rewards. I want to look at my operatives first. Let's look back because it has been almost the whole year. Oh my god. Hold on. Wait. Can we actually, like, track? Oh my god. So they're still updating the single player. So we can actually travel to um, 
uh, where our other operatives are. That is absolutely crazy. I actually really like that. We've got a new mission in the um, safe house as well. We're going to see anyone we recognize. We've got Helen the granny over there. Everybody knows about Helen. Let's travel to Lynx. So you can actually travel to see your operative now. Located an interesting potential recruit for you. They claim to have recently escaped from, am I paraphrasing here, an evil lab. Oh, is this about some people in the season pass? Okay. Sick. We need to recruit this girl. I have the same thought. Wherever they came from, they'll be a valuable asset to the resistance. I'll set up a meeting for you. Alright, I'm flagging okay, you to for you. You have to promise not to make a mess in your pants when you hear who it is. I'm listening. It seems none other than Aiden Pierce has made his way to London. Yeah, so he's updating our single player with the season pass content now. Sick. We need to recruit this dog. <laughs> Look at this. Who the fuck is this? You see what I'm dealing with here? His credentials check out. Just give him something to do to get him off my ass, would you? Oh, new operatives, Aiden Pierce, Darcy, uh, Darcy Clarkson, Mina Sadu, that's the Jedi looking person, and Wrench, of course. So Darcy is the Assassin's Creed crossover, which I personally don't care about. That is so cool! That's so that's new as well, by the way. So you can actually go around the city now and actually look at where your operatives are. That was not a thing before. Uh, that never uh, these missions now. So the villains of London. I remember the story. It was so much fun. Uh, now, I actually don't remember certain characters, but I do remember Zero Day was Sabine. Uh, Mary Kelly was there. I forgot the Albion guy's name, but it, it's Nigel Cass. That's it, Nigel Cass. Uh, we got Sky Larson and then the Spy Guy, which I don't really remember much for the Spy missions, if I'm going to be honest. But the Sky Larson missions are the highlight of this game. Honestly, if I had more time on my hands, Watch Dogs Legion, we would have replayed through it already by now. I'm probably going to replay through it one day, you know? I really want to, because I do like the story for this game. I think it's so much better than Watch Dogs 2. In certain aspects, it's actually, like, got more content in within its story than the first Watch Dogs did, even though that's one of my favorite games ever. But, yeah, the... Uh, Mary Kelly and uh, Sky Larson missions are the highlight of this game, and I wish we could replay missions. I know you can replay certain missions in Watch Dogs 2. I really wish they would add a feature where you could replay um, missions from the story in this game. All right, so we got side missions. The more you resist, the more powerful your enemies become. There are people in London who would go to any lengths to take down DedSec. Whatever happens, they need to be stopped. Okay, so we got Caitlyn, uh, which is the Clan Kelly expansion. Mina, so that's the Jedi stuff. We've got Wrench, we've got Aiden. So I wonder what those missions will be like. Um, I probably should have live streamed this, but I don't want to. I don't want to live stream Watch Dogs Legion again until I play Bloodline, you know. So I ain't doing that. But we'll see how this goes. And this is the recruitment missions these, uh, to do different operatives. Right, let's look at our team. Are they actually not in our team yet? No, they're not. We actually have to uh, get them recruited. But there's Aiden Pierce. Here's Darcy. Here's Mina and Wrench. I actually already have all of these guys in online, so I've already played a little bit of their gameplay. Uh, I've not played Bloodline, like I said, but again, we shall get to that. So let's actually do a mission and let's recruit. Uh, I don't really care about... M not sure about Mina. Uh, if this video does well enough, maybe I'll uh, do the Mina missions, but I don't care about Darcy's missions, wherever that one is. Uh... Is that Assassin's Contracts? This is it, right? Uh, yeah, I just don't care for it, if I'm going to be honest, because, again, I don't even like uh, Assassin's Creed. I think Assassin's Creed is <laughs> so boring. Like, uh, I hate it. I hate it. I really do. Unity looks, uh, looks okay, but that was, like, really broken at launch. I don't know. Like, if I ever get any criticism for how my reactions are towards Assassin's Creed... 
I will I will most likely buy an Assassin's Creed game at one point at some point and actually uh, play it right so we're gonna go do Eden's mission let's go do that one swipe right it says but that's not the mission we're looking for Someone what the around. fuck are you doing? The Aiden Pierce people obviously I will be live streaming bloodline at some point the plan is to do it on the 29th which is last night <laughs> so if I have done it you'll see if I haven't done it you'll also see <laughs> Anyway, let's get going then. Oh, I, I keep forgetting we need to drive on the left. We're in my country, England. <laughs> I was so hyped when um, it showed that this game was in London. I got the... I was so hyped I pre-ordered the game. Uh, fun story, by the way, and I've told this multiple times, but I think I'll get a little bit more viewers on this video. Maybe. I hope so. But I bought the Resistance Edition uh, for this game, which has an amazing cover. It has the best cover of all of them, but I was actually supposed to buy the gold edition like the i was i was meant to pre-order the gold edition of Watch Dogs legion but i left 20 pounds at home uh by accident and uh yeah I, I had to make do with getting the resistance edition do i regret it no not really i have all the content now that i would have gotten with the gold edition but also the resistance edition has the best cover like i just said so you know it's it worked it all worked out well in the end really um, Resistance Edition, by the way, is exclusive to the UK. So if you're American and watching this and you don't know what the Resistance Edition is, don't worry, you didn't miss out. You, well, you did, uh, but it wasn't like something you didn't see. It's something that you couldn't have seen because it, it's UK exclusive. I actually think it was exclusive to uh, game. Oh. Hell, I don't even know how this uh, video is going to record right, because I know with certain games that the recording software doesn't work properly, but with Need for Speed Heat recently, it's been just fine. So hopefully this video is fine. I really hope so. But yeah, we are... Wait, why? Oh, okay. That was a one-way street. Oh, we made the HQ. Okay. What the fuck? Okay. <laughs> right. What's our mask like? What do we have on our mask? Oh, yeah. Look at that. We got an ex dead sec member here. Who's this? Oh, Patricia, I remember you. We got Mina Sadu over here. We got Wrench. Oh, they're all waiting outside of the pub. Cool. Who's this guy then? Wait, no. Who are you? Who are you? I'm just a dancer. You don't like dead sec. Okay, I don't really care. Aiden Pierce. Here he is in the flesh. You alright? You alright? Hey, you're looking for dead sec. I know, I know where you are. You can hide in plain sight from most people. Most people don't know what to look for. Why don't you join that set? You know you want to. I've never really been into team sports, but I'm going to be here for a while. Nice. I like you, but you used to help out with sort of contract basis. I could do the same for you. I really want to replay through the story with Aiden. Hope you'd say that. See in the feet. Say hi to Connie for me. Nice. I don't know the story between Aiden and Connie, if I'm being honest. Can we scan? No, I can't. Who's this? It's not coming up. What's this over here, then? Oh, wait. Okay, let's go in here. So this is the HQ. Apparently they've done some... Oh, my God. <laughs> Apparently they've done some... I wonder if we could fight Aiden. I should have gone back and fought Aiden. <laughs> this is cool, by the way. I love this. Uh, one thing I do have to point out that I actually haven't pointed out yet is uh, my distaste for the loading screens for Legion. I don't know what it is, but it honestly feels like they had a lot less of a budget going into Legion. And I think I'll re-pull up this point in the online video that I do. Uh, because compared to Watch Dogs 1 and Watch Dogs 2, this game feels a lot less... Um, polished even now even after all these updates that again doesn't make legion bad at all i think watchdogs legion is like still one of the best games ubisoft have put out recently it's definitely better than any assassin's creed game in the past few years but you know what i mean so this is connie uh aiden's over here expose the mayor of chicago for murder i remember that we got the gbb special report as well we got a 
bunch of missions here that we can still do. I think if my next couple videos on Legion do well, I think I'll definitely do more videos on the single player. But yeah, I'm planning three. I'm planning a trilogy of videos on Legion, including this one. And then, of course, got the online portion. And then we're going to talk about the future of Watch Dogs Legion and, in turn, the future of Watch Dogs itself. Uh, but, yeah, I think we're going to now switch to Aiden and um, maybe do one of the missions. I don't know. Let's swap. Of course, we got to get the other operatives as well. So, I think we'll go talk to Wrench. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, I'm also do going to do the Bloodline missions as well. Oh, yes, I forgot. Some operatives have exclusive loading screens. I honestly think if this is a new development team working on Watch Dogs Legion, this could be a foundation for things to come. But I don't want it to be a foundation Good game. Absolutely. Let's take back the city. Amazing. Alright, so first of all, I want to see if we can actually customize Aiden. Um, I know I've got it. Oh my god, you're still here? That's the spy guy. Mate, you've been in prison for a year. I hope we're feeding you. <laughs> okay, I, I think that's literally kidnapping. Alright, so beard. We could actually remove the beard, should we want to. Or we can just buy stubble for him. I don't know if I want to do that, to be honest. Um... We can go in the wardrobe. I think we can put on Helen's stuff because it does look... Uh, where is Helen's um, jumper? This one, isn't it? See, it does It does look a lot like Aiden's thing from um, the first game. So we'll do that. Handwear, we definitely want... Um, this is cool. We've got some gold, gold gloves there. Nice. But I think we'll just stick with these. These look great. And it, it kind of suits Aiden's uh, aesthetic. Uh, in terms of... Yeah, let's get the beard off. How's this going to look? Okay. Blending in. Is it now? Okay. Oh, okay. That is that is That works. That works really well. Uh, masks. What do you have in terms of masks? You have your actual one. That is perfect. Okay. We've got Aiden looking a bit younger. He's not as powerful as he was in Watch Dogs 1. I know in Bloodline, he's actually pretty weak at the beginning. But, I, and I wonder why that is. Again, I've not actually played... A, I've, not see, I've not even seen a lot of Bloodline. Um, I've just seen the best... I've, I've, probably, I've seen the highlights, okay? Like, uh, the scene with... Uh, where Jackson goes into Aiden's mind. And the fact that Jackson Pierce is in it and he's all grown up, which is going to be so cool to actually experience for myself. Uh, I'm actually much more excited to play Watch Dogs Legion Bloodline than I am to play GTA San Andreas Definitive Edition. But yeah, look at this. Oh my God. It's like, this is nostalgic. It met me. Brings back so many memories of playing um, the first Watch Dogs. But now we're in London, and it's great. I love it What's so much. Is that any way to greet your new boss? I'm fucking with you. Come on. Everyone knows that doesn't have a boss. Think of me more of a cool old brother. Right. you occasionally have done things about him. Well, I don't like this. Hey, hey. I'm just a boy. Standing in front of a resistance group, asking them to let me beat up some dudes with a sledgehammer for them. Is that so wrong? Is it? Oh, fine. Fuck yeah, yeah. See you out there. You. Whatever your name is. Get out of here. Man, they really should have built in a proper conversation between Aiden and Wrench, because y'all know each other from. Bloodline, which is a prequel to this game. And the fact you don't know who Aiden Pierce is anyway. Man, the the beard. I, I don't know, man. Everyone knows what Aiden Pierce looks like. I don't know. Let's actually do a mission then. Let's see what we got. Um, so I might do... Let's do Caitlyn's request. Let's actually track this and do this. Okay, what we got? Oh, the blackout. It still exists. Okay, we need to do that again at night time. Do you want to stop? Oh, I'll take the taxi instead. 
Nothing says London like a taxi like this. Let's go. Woo! All right, let's go do this mission then, and of course talk a bit more about Watch Dogs Legion. I really like it. I know a lot of people. It's divisive, and that is one thing that Watch Dogs had the first game, uh, and it's always valid criticisms. Like it, the fact that it is divisive is pretty valid, to be fair. Um, but does that make the game bad? How is Wrench over here already? I don't know, but we'll be able to find Aiden and Wrench while using other characters. That is really cool. I'm looking forward to replaying through this game again with Aiden, Wrench, etc. It's going to be really cool. I also do plan to buy more stuff from this game, but because like there's a specific pack. I wonder if I could actually show you. There's a specific pack that I actually want to buy. Uh, from this and it's uh, the cosmetic bundle here it is legacies bundle I fucking love this and I hope they plan to do a year two for Watch Dogs Legion hopefully we get an announcement soon I don't want there to be a next Watch Dogs game just yet because honestly with the way they've treated online I, I'm not even gonna and the fact that this game was mostly broken at launch even though I did have a lot of fun with it, I will say that I had a lot of fun with this, but there was a lot of problems at launch. But that doesn't take away the fact that I really, really fucking enjoyed this game. Uh, and I want to play through it again, I just need time. <laughs> um, but yeah, the chances of that happening will be significantly slim, should there not be a year two for this game. Honestly, online cannot be left as it is, it's so bad and obviously... Uh, I can't help but touch upon that because I need to. Yeah, this is more of a let's play, uh, whereas the online video is going to be uh, more of a retrospective, like a proper concise review, you know? Uh, but yeah, I do love looking back on games in this capacity. I've done it for Need for Speed 2015. I've done it for Need for Speed Hot Pursuit Remastered very recently. And I wanted to do it for uh, this game because... You know, I really do. I do love Watch Dogs Legion. It is one of my favorite games released uh, in the last couple years. Uh, and I have played it quite a lot. It's just recently in the last few months I haven't. I only did one video on Season 2 and only one video on Season 3. Oh my god, what was that? Um, <laughs> again, there are still a few bugs, which does fit into my theory that um, I think Watch Dogs Legion was sabotaged, kind of. Like, I think it had a lot less of a budget, and I just, I don't know. I don't know what the plans for Watch Dogs are. I just know that the developers are trying, and they do communicate, okay? Unlike Rockstar with the GTA Trilogy and GTA 5. Like vultures gathering around a carcass. Means we're on the right track. Yeah, so like GTA 5 Expanded and Enhanced Rockstar are just not uh, interacting with their fans. Um, but I will say that Ubisoft, um, whatever the mini developers are uh, that are under the Ubisoft umbrella, I think they've done a good job with what they've clearly had to work with. They've definitely had a lower budget than what um was had for the original Watch Dogs specifically and Watch Dogs 2. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's because of the performance of those games. I know they got they had a much bigger budget for Watch Dogs 2 because Watch Dogs 1 did really well, but Watch Dogs 2 didn't do nearly as well as Watch Dogs 1 did. Um so maybe that's why they had a lower budget for Legion. So the future of Watch Dogs is I'm very skeptical on it. I'm really unsure of what they're going to do in the future uh, but we'll have to see we have to find the closed circuit terminal and first we need to get over this somehow which I don't know Aiden looks really good in this game I'm not even gonna lie he looks great he's got that older vibe about him and honestly I think I've made it a little better because I've changed his beard he looks great with the stubble instead of the proper full-on beard we need to actually find a way in here this is a mission that I wanted to do like fucking a year ago, but I never got around to doing the side missions because I started focusing on the online portion uh, at that point for season one. Um, but yeah, that's really about it. Let's jump down here. 
Okay. We want to get here. Can we not do anything with the riot drone? I guess not. Let's duck under... Ah! Why have I got a spider drone? I should have changed it to the invisibility. Okay. I've not played this for a while, so if I fucking suck... Oh, this is Albion's spot. Wait, are we even meant to be here? Yeah, yeah, okay. We good. Oh, that works. I pressed the wrong button. <laughs> Run! That is not good. I should have also changed the weapons. Oh, I do. Oh my god, okay. This was a horrible idea. I doubt the gun is trying to like that to get their cup scouts not tied back. Heroptic sick lock suggests that this is our thing. Or this is all a setup and we're walking into a trap. Well, I need to fucking run! <laughs> Get in there, get in there, and we gotta run now. Jesus! Okay, that was a horrible start. We we should have actually stealthed through that, but I've clearly forgotten the controls for this game, and you can tell I have not played in a while. That is literally Premier in, by the way. I love it. Like, this place seems... It feels so different, but also so diff... Uh, also so familiar. I, I find it so cool. I think they did a great job in this. Oh, have I found a spy? No, I haven't. I found a spy car. I think there's meant to be a spy here, but it's a it's just a weapons deal. Okay. Right, let's get up here then. All right, attempt number two. Let's try this again. First of all, we're actually going to change the um, the gadget we're using here. The AR cloak needs to be the one we use. In terms of weapons, um, long reload time, burst fire rifle. We've got, oh my god, yeah, Aiden's got like a full arsenal. Look at this shit. Now, I don't know what I've actually gone with in terms of pure weapons, but I think we're going with that. And we've got a semi auto shotgun right there. There you go. Yeah, Aiden's arsenal. Okay, so he still has all the weapons pretty much. He's still a powerhouse. It wouldn't have made sense if he weren't. Because he was a powerhouse in the first game. I'll tell you that right now. Okay, let's try this again. Unlock this. Boom. Let's shut things down. Beautiful. <laughs> oh, voice crack. Beautiful. Oh my god, that fucking came out of nowhere. Gotcha, bitch. Oh my god, run! Gotcha. Okay, Aiden is still a beast. Oh shit, wait, was that something else? Okay. I'm really relying on the aim assist here because... Um, did I get that? Okay, I don't know. Yeah, because my I've got stick drift. Got it. Oh, okay. I got something good there. Nice! Okay, we are doing really good. Oh, wait, does it, like, overheat and stuff? Oh, we need to get in here to this person. We need to go all the way up there. Right, okay. Let's go. Alright, if we get in trouble again, we can also use the blackout. Which is awesome. Oh, shit. Blackout. Yeah, get out of here.
Oh, not a good idea. We need to get all the way up there. Oh. Tricky, tricky, tricky. Uh, right, we need to get up here somewhere. Where's the staircase for this? It's up here. Alright, let's go. Doing a really good job so far. Aiden is a beast. I would always struggle with the other guys. Is it up here? I, hope, I bloody hope so. God, I forget the controls for this so much. He knows where we are, though, this guy. Oh my god, how do I get in there? How am I, how, what the fuck, how are you meant to get up there? Okay, he's over there, can he see me? I'm not sure. I think he can. Let's get down again. Come on, bitch. Get down! Climb down! Okay. I really need to find a way to get there. Wait. We were able to shoot it earlier. So maybe I could do that again? Perhaps? Perhaps. Let's try that again. <clears throat> so we've got to rescue the captive accountant. Oh, you can do that. I never actually knew you could do that. Let's go. I think that's everything dealt with now. Wow, playing with Aiden is actually a lot fucking easier. Hopefully he has all these weapons in Bloodline, but I, again, that'll make Bloodline, like, really fucking easy. <laughs> anyway, we've made it. Clearly. Oh, we should probably keep the guns out. Close that. Alright, I got you. The fox, the vigilante, he's here. How is he hitting me from here? Escort the accountant to safety, right. <coughs> oh my god. Gotcha, bitch. Right, let's go. I think that's it. I think we literally dealt with... What do you mean hostage can't reach me? They're there. Anyway, we can now get out of here. You are now safe. Get out of here. We're done. Oh, wait. Do I need to talk to you now? Oh, I do. Okay. Let's talk. Let's go. Thank you. Thank you. I was, I was about, about to get to the get Clan Kelly P45. No gold, just that. But I'm but done with all of it. Organized by London. For these graphics. Tell us how That's you've been how you've stealing, stealing from, from the Kellys. Kellys. Then we'll call it even. My sure. God, Ada, why are you smiling? <laughs> their dirty money into cryptocurrency. A lot of it. Keep talking. I set up I set a keylogger key to capture the passwords I needed to hijack the operation. Divert all the cash out of their crypto wallets. Need treasure. Can't wait, wait to try it on the Kellys myself. Oh hell yeah. Maybe I will do more videos on this. I'm actually really enjoying this. I don't know. But I also want to do another thing here. Because, um... We're going to become Wrench. And we are going to go to a Bear Knuckle the tournament. The you might need a spider bot when you get there. Probably a good place to start looking. Spider bot, huh? Easy. I'll just switch gadgets to the spider bot. But now we are going to switch to wrench. And, um, yeah, go to a bare knuckle tournament. Uh, nice. <laughs> uh, let's actually have a look at wrench then. What are these weapons? We've got Princess Ratatata, okay, and we've got Captain Boom Boom, okay, nice. Not summon Sur Sergi, okay, Ninja Balls, Lady Smash. I love Wrench. Wrench was my favorite part of Watch Dogs 2, I'm not going to lie. I do love this new outfit as well. All right, we'll take this Mini Cooper. Okay, we're now going to a bare knuckle tournament because, oh my god, 
uh, those that was one of my favorite parts of this game. Um, I don't know where one is. I know well, I know where one is specifically because there was always this one place where I always went to the bare knuckle tournaments, which is over here. Uh, can we fast travel to one of these? We can't. Let's get going. I mean, we could go to one of the train stations, but honestly, let's just drive. <sighs> this controller's got stick drift. I'm so sorry. But anyway, here we are. I've not played this game. I'm playing this game on PS4, by the way. Specifically PS4 Pro. Um, so I've not played it to where it's best yet. Oh, and now it's nighttime. I, I could have, like, done a blackout as Aiden. Hopefully it's still nighttime by the time we're done with the Bare Knuckle League, because then we'll switch to Aiden. But if not, I'll do it at some other point. It's okay. But yeah. I do still enjoy Watch Dogs Legion. When I'm doing something in it, when I'm actually doing a mission or whatever, I'm still enjoying it. This is the single player, though. So, um, of course I'm still enjoying it. I just know with online, I ne that makes any sense, you know? I just... I don't know. I did like Legion of the Dead, though. The last live stream we did on Watch Dogs, they also brought back Invasion for Legion. But, I, again, it's just too late at this point. The the For online, the damage is already... I'm just going to say it now, even though I'm going to make a whole new video about it in about a month's time. Just less than a month's time. But what I think they should do is not make a new Watch Dogs game and just... Oh, my God. This car is horrible to drive. Um, at least at top speed it is. My God, look at this. <laughs> Oh my god, okay, um, so what was I saying? Yeah, what I think they should do is just not make a new Watch Dogs game and just stay focused on Legion. In terms of the single player, it's still great, and I think if they want to keep adding to it, then sure, do that. Amazing. I'm still enjoying the single player every time I hop onto it, but I think in terms of online, make it free to play. Online needs to be free to play. Um... And you need to put all the most of the budget into online now. Like that needs vastly improving. Not gonna lie, it really does need it. I, d I don't know what else to say. It just desperately needs it. Anyway, here we are though. This is where I always go in online to do bare knuckle leagues. Always. Even though you don't really get much from doing the bare knuckle league, it's still great. I wonder. Yeah, since Wrench has a hammer, um, will he be using that? Whatever, here we go. This was one of my favorite parts of the whole game. I need to do, I need to do a video where we actually take a granny into the Bare Knuckle League. I think that would be so, that, I think that'd be funny. I think that would be actually hilarious. We'll take Helen. We'll take Helen into the Bare Knuckle League. Anyway, here we go. All right, Kirk Dowling, meet Wrench. Here we go. Oh, he isn't bringing the hammer. Can you imagine if he did? <laughs> Ow! Come on, bitch, let's go. Dodge him! God damn it. Okay. Oh, he even spat out blood through the mask, bro. This guy hit me hard. Ow, how do you dodge those? Get out of here. Get out. Woo. Honestly, this is one of the best parts of the game for me. So good. Sorina Stanku. More like Sorina Stinku. That was never going to hit me. Okay, that was. Stop hitting those uppercuts. Yeah, nice try. Oh! Oh! Damn. She got her ass kicked. We still not made it to the main guy. Michelle Martin. Okay. Or Michael. Mikel? Mikel. Ow. Oh, he got me good. Ow! Jesus! Give me space, bro! That guy was whooping my ass! 
Oh, nice. That was a really good hit. Come on, bitch. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, what a dodge. Get out of here. Nope. Woo! Boom! Get out. Get out. Get out. All right. We've now reached the final. Let's do it. Alright, who are you? Wolf! A guy named Wolf. Okay, maybe I'll recruit you. He's got nothing special about him though. I do like his outfit though, he looks nice. I'll probably recruit him. Let's go bitch, let's go. This guy's gonna be easy. Oh, damn. Ow! Oh, he hits hard though, he hits hard. Oh, he's gonna kill me. I'm actually gonna lose. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. I will not lose. I shall not lose. I got him. Boom! There you go. 300 ETO. That's not bad. You know, that ain't bad. Those pay more now. 300 ETO is pretty fucking good. Okay. There you go. I like the look of you, kid. You want to join dead sec? Whew, that was nice. That is one of my favorite parts of Watch Dogs Legion. For sure. For sure. Okay. Yeah, fast knockouts. That's why he almost killed us. All right. Save him to recruits. And there you go. Let's swap back to um, Radu. I think that's his name anyway. My main dude. Here he is. Raju. Boom. This is the guy I put most of my effort in, in terms of, like, outfits and stuff. Actually, this is the guy I, sp I completed the game with, if I remember rightly. But, yeah. There you have it, folks. Is Wrench nearby? I don't know. But, yeah. There you go. That was the return to Watch Dogs Legion. Watch Dogs Legion, one year later. It's still fun. Single player wise, like the proper game wise, it's still fun. If you've never played Watch Dogs Legion before, what have you been doing with your life? Actually get it. Honestly, get it over the GTA Trilogy. Like if you're contemplating getting the GTA Trilogy, I guarantee you will be more satisfied with this one. Also, this is one of the coolest, uh, coolest stores ever. I, I just really wish online was so much better. I really wish we could have got more out of online, but of course, I will be making a video on that very soon. So, yeah, keep your eyes out for that one. And uh, until next time, I shall see you all in the next video. Peace.